Physics is about deciphering the secrets of the world, from the smallest particles to the largest scales in the universe. Our faculty researches the uh, different questions that come up when you're trying to understand how this world works. The Department of Physics at the Technion has 40 faculty. We research a wide variety of fields of physics, both theoretical and experimental, both fundamental and applied. We have 500 students that include both undergraduates and graduates. We have a master's program and we have a PhD program. The Technion has modern laboratories that allow us to do cutting edge experiments, acoustic black holes in Bose-Einstein condensates, lasing and topological insulators, qubits of different forms in atoms, photonics, and solid state systems. We have a group that builds and designs experiments for CERN, the largest particle accelerator in Geneva. They were part of the discovery of the Higgs boson. We have a high quality group of researchers in astrophysics and cosmology. My own research focuses on high energy astrophysics. We research violent phenomena around black holes and cosmic explosions. We have an ongoing collaboration with NASA to build instruments for the space station to detect gamma ray bursts from events of mergers of neutron stars and black holes that also emit gravitational waves. The atomic, molecular and, and the optical physics group at the Technion, we are really at the cutting edge of research in those areas in the world. We are just five people. We have four year segments. The reason that we are doing so well is because we are able to think beyond the horizon to go where nobody has gone before. In 2013, we started a new area that is now called topological photonics. It's a major research area that was started in my lab by a postdoc and a student. Here, things are operating together. So we don't always collaborate, but we always discuss openly. And that helps a lot and it creates, a, it gives rise to new ideas and so forth. I've had uh, around 50 PhD students and postdocs. 21 of them are university professors, six at the Technion, uh, three more in Israel. Some of them are now professors at Princeton and MIT, University of Michigan, and several other leading places worldwide. I encourage discussion and arguments, and I educate my students not to follow the path of others, rather to carve their own path, to think beyond the horizon. In our department, we cover the entire spectrum of quantum science and technology from the theoretical side of what, in principle, quantum computers could do, compute, to the other end of device building, designing the most advanced components of a quantum computer, like uh, ideal qubits and the other major components. Physics department and other departments in the Technion are offering a new program in the quantum science and technology, which offers both theoretical and experimental education in this area. There are two reasons for coming especially to the Technion in Haifa. First, the program in quantum science and technology depends heavily on technology and we have the most prestigious engineering school in Israel. And the second reason is that the Technion has a wonderful tradition in quantum mechanics, starting with Nathan Rosen, who was Albert Einstein's assistant who started the department. The biophysics group at Technion is unique. We have three excellent experimentalists and three excellent theorists. And the dialogue between the experimental groups and the theoretical group is extensive. It's very fruitful and very unique to this place. Our research focuses on the interaction between biomolecules in biologically relevant solutions. Turns out that water plays an important ingredient in those interactions. You cannot really understand the interactions, say, between proteins or between proteins and, and DNA without understanding water structure. To study the effect of water on those interactions and the water structure next to those objects, we develop ultra-high resolution atomic force microscope that let us image the water structure next to those objects and this way understand the way they affect the interactions. Probably the best known achievement, at least in recent years, of biophysics group is the harnessing of molecular biology to the self-assembly of electronic devices made of completely non-biological materials. It would be fair to say that nanotechnology to a large extent started here with the establishment of the Russell Berry Nanotechnology Institute in the early 2000s, and the establishment of this uh, institute catalyzed or spearheaded 
the nanotechnology revolution in the whole state of Israel. High Energy Physics at the Technion spans a wide range of activity, from theory to experiment. We're after the answers to the most basic questions in physics. Uh, for example, why is the weak force weak? What pins down the Higgs particle, which was recently discovered? And we research these questions uh, through a combination of theoretical and experimental activity, focused on the Large Hadron Collider at CERN, where we can study the properties of the Higgs boson and any other new particles over the next few decades. There is a lot of synergy between particle theorists and experimentalists here at the Technion. We talk a lot together. We talk about possible theoretical extensions of the standard model of the fundamental interactions. And we think together about ways to test for these in experiment, in particular in the ATLAS detector of the LHC. My research is focused on finding evidence for new physics at the LHC. And I have additional research programs to design and build new experiments that will take place at the LHC in the next phases or beyond the LHC. We have very close collaboration between theorists and experimentalists. Technion has excellent high-tech orientation, which is important for high energy physics today. We have very good students and very good postdocs, which make this research possible. The students at the Department of Physics in the Technion benefit from studying in a world-leading, excellent research institute. They enjoy the exciting and international atmosphere on our campus in Haifa, and they benefit from collaboration with our satellite campuses in the U.S. and in China. Our graduates are leaders in academia and in high-tech industry and business, both in Israel and around the world.